The collection of presidential nomination forms in the two leading political parties is throwing up a lot of dark horses, an indication that the emergence of presidential candidates may take a surprising turn. One of the names touted is CBN Governor Gordon Emefile, and those rooting for his emergence insist his efficient management of the Central Bank of Nigeria reflects the fact that he will be able to handle the bigger task of managing the country. Tai Amodu reports. Despite the heavily criticized decision of the All Progressives Congress to peg the cost of its presidential form at 100 million naira, those who have indicated interest in running for president have almost hit 30. So far, 12 aspirants have purchased the presidential nomination form. But one name has been raising a lot of controversy, Godwin Emefiele. There's no gain saying the fact that the Central Bank of Nigeria under Godwin Emefiele has become more humane, intervening in situations that directly affect the common man. Some experts have termed the people-oriented policies under which the CBN has operated in the last seven years economic nationalism. Currently, the CBN has 37 intervention funds targeted at stimulating the economy and addressing the issue of unemployment. The Anko Borrower Scheme in particular has recorded tremendous success. These are successes that are enough to justify his emergence as a presidential aspirant. And in the past few weeks, some groups have been pushing for his involvement in the 2023 presidential race under the platform of the All Progressive Congress. A group of associates have even gone ahead and picked a nomination form for him, raising 100 million naira in the process and promising to raise even more to support his campaign. But Mr. Emifiel's emergence has raised a lot of questions, with many challenging the propriety of his throwing his hat in the ring while still a serving civil servant and governor of the country's Apex Bank. Former Vice President of the World Bank, Dr. Obi Ezekiel is one of those who believes Mr. Emefiele should resign immediately. She says in a tweet, The Governor of Central Bank of Nigeria at Sem Bank must now immediately tender his resignation to stop further destroying whatever little remains of the country's monetary policy reputation. Mr. Emefiele should immediately leave tonight to pursue his ill-fated political career. The Southwest Governors Forum is also not comfortable with Mr. Emefiele's seeming emergence, describing it as an act, if unchecked timelessly, portends great danger to the fragile economy of the country. It insists that should Mr. Emefiele proceed to submit the forms while occupying seat as Governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria, he will be contravening the public service rules, the CBN Act, and the 1999 Constitution as amended.